This morning I've been thinking about how grateful I am and really how fortunate I am that I was taught early on in my Christianity to put the word in my heart, right? To read it and listen to it and memorize it and really burn it into my heart. And the reason that's important is because when difficult things happen, when we go through what everybody goes through in life, the word is there and it comes back up. Um, at times when we need it. And that's been the case for me. And it just so happens that today I woke up, I was feeling a little down. We all have those days, right? But I had this thought, um, build yourself up in your most holy faith. And that is actually a scripture. And I didn't remember the reference for the scripture. I usually don't remember the references. I just remember the words. Um, so I Googled it. I just Googled scripture, build yourself up. And a whole list popped up. And that particular scripture was at the top of the list. And it is actually from the book of Jude. It's Jude 20, because Jude is just one chapter. And it literally says, build yourself up in your most holy faith. And it was a reminder for me today that I can do that, that on days where, you know, I wake up feeling down or, or frustrated or whatever it is, like life is heavy, that I can um, build myself up because of what the Word of God says about me, because of the faith that I have in Jesus. But I noticed something when I looked at that list of scriptures. I noticed that the only one that was telling me to build myself up uh, was the first one. And the rest of those scriptures were actually about building other people up in their faith. And I remembered that while it's important that we build ourselves up, because it is, it's important that we know who we are in Christ. It is equally, if not more important, that we build others up, that we reach out to those around us and help build them up in their faith. And so this morning, that's what I want to do. I want to get on here and encourage you because maybe you woke up today feeling heavy. Maybe you woke up today feeling, I don't know, down, frustrated with life, whatever it is. I want to remind you of who you are. I want to remind you today that you are a child of the Most High God. In fact, the Word of God calls us kings and priests. The Bible tells us that the Lord of all creation, the one who made the heavens and the earth and everything that we see, he crafted you with his own hand. He looked around and saw what he made and decided that he wanted one of you. He gave you very specific gifts and skills and talents. And he placed you in time in history today for a reason. See, you're here with purpose. You're not here by accident. You are here for a purpose. And so when you go out into the world today, think about that. Think about the fact that you are victorious. You're an overcomer. That you're his and he loves you. He calls you valued and highly favored. And if you don't know Jesus, maybe you're watching this and you're like, yeah, whatever, lady. I want you to know that he loves you, that he paid a very high price for you. For anything you may have done or anything that might have been done to you, he has redemption planned for you. He's crafted you and made you with purpose. So, I hope that you guys have an amazing day.